Well, today we're going to be celebrating Christmas. Oh, how awesome. This is my favorite time of year. We get to give gifts. We get to enjoy one another. We get to be home and enjoy each other and family together. There will be people all over the world in different places. You know, you could be in Hawaii. You could be in Michigan. You could be in Florida. You could be in Oklahoma. Or you could be in California. But you know what? It's not where you're at, but who you're with. That's right. And we're with our family today. And we're with our families through the video that we're doing today. We just want to wish you all a very Merry Christmas from the Salem family. And we just want you to know how important you are to us and to our family ministry. And this has been a family ministry for over 20 years now. And we're just so thankful that you'd stand with us and allow us to be part of your family. So from our family. Yes, we wish you a very, very Merry Christmas. We want to remind you that Christmas is all about the birth of our Savior, Jesus Christ. You know, I was thinking about something. It, it seems like one king brought frankincense, another brought myrrh, and one brought gold. But really the one king that made a huge difference was the king that brought us hope. The king that we celebrate his birth today. That is the King Jesus that we celebrate. And thank you, Jesus, for bringing us the hope of the world. That's the celebration. You know, there's an old song that said, Mary, did you know? You know, when she conceived him in the, in the book of Luke, it says Mary did know. And she pondered things in her heart. She kept things secret for the right time. At the moment when, in the book of John, it talks about her, when she ignited him or launched him into his healing ministry, his miracle ministry. And you know, that's the thing today that we think about mothers. We think about Mary as the mother. She's not a saint, but she was the mother of Jesus. But I also think about at the cross when Jesus very took his very last breath he had turned to John. He said, here, John, here's your mother. And he said to his mother, here's your son. To the very last minute, Jesus took care of his mother. And it's all about family. So once again, from the Salem family, from Roman, Stephanie, and Harry III, my wife Cheryl, and myself, we want to wish you a very Merry Christmas. And wherever you are, know that we love you and we appreciate you and we celebrate the birth of our soon-coming King. Merry Christmas.